Welcome back to Tain Slade Info. We all know that the future vertical lift program is meant to develop replacements for a variety of helicopters which are operated by the United States Army. The helicopters which I'm talking about here are the UH-60 Black Hawk, the AH-64 Apache, the CH-47 Chinook and OH-58 Kiowa helicopters. In a major boost for the order book of Bell, the United States Army has awarded the contract for its next generation helicopter that will replace the Black Hawk utility choppers. The helicopter which would replace this Black Hawk is going to be V-280 Valor. To be more precise, the United States Army has selected Bell's V-280 Valor tilt rotor helicopter as a basis for the design that will replace the Sikorsky UH-60 Black Hawk helicopter as its next future long-range assault aircraft. And this was announced on December 5, 2022. V-280 Valor was designed, built and tested in flight for over three years and the aircraft's technological and operational advantages for the long-range assault role has been carefully evaluated by the United States Army before going for the same. The V-280 is built for a top speed of 320 miles per hour and a range of 2,100 nautical miles, a cruising speed of 320 miles per hour and an effective combat range of 580 to 920 miles. The maximum takeoff weight is anticipated to be around 30,000 pounds and unlike the very similar Boeing V-22 Osprey tilt rotor, the engines on the V-280 are kept in position while the rotors and the drive shafts tilt. According to Bell, this award is a potential financial bonanza for Bell and it guarantees its continuation as United States military's long-term rotorcraft supplier. So that was a small and a quick video to provide an update on the United States Army's decision to replace the Black Hawk helicopter fleet slowly using the Bell V-280 Valor tilt rotor helicopter. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tainslade Info for more defense and aviation related updates. Thank you.